The cameras are fixed to one man. Four goals in three games. You can't argue with that. The action is live next. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live coverage of the Carabao Cup. It's Derby County, and they take on Wrexham. Thanks, Derek. Well, the hosts are clear favourites going into this tie. But with that comes pressure, particularly against a team that will remain compact, are well-drilled defensively, and are a threat on the counter-attack. If the hosts don't go through, though, it will be a major upset. And number 10, Tom Lawrence. And here's how it looks for Derby County. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, no surprise, really. They're matching up here. But there are many different ways they can approach this game. And I just think they'll be cautious today, certainly early on. Thank you. Enjoy the game. And now they get the ball rolling. It is a decent looking attack here. It needs an accurate cross. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Tom Lawrence. Morrison and possession given away well we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch but what should we expect from him today Stuart well Derek he's playing well at the moment he's confident he's making runs in behind he... well the keeper had a lot of ground to cover splendid save Can someone get on the end of this? Well, the header at least made the goalkeeper think. Bielik. Now, what can they produce on the flank? It is to be a throw in. And you saw the situation developing. Jackie Elka. Fluency of movement. Bird. Tom Lawrence. Just the challenge that was required. Reese Hall Johnson. Sliding in, winning the ball, and once more they've kept it. 
Morrison. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. And charging through. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. Goalkeeper error. Well, here's the replay. Yes, it's a decent shot, but the goalkeeper has to do a lot better there. He's parried it out into a dangerous area, and suddenly the ball's in the back of his net. It's poor goalkeeping, you have to say. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Mullen James Jones well that is how to nullify the opposition well the attack will peter out keeper's ball Lawrence Morrison Can he put it away? Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. And over comes the corner. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Now what can they do from here? Fruitful looking attack. Oh, a lovely ball. And woodwork rather than net on that occasion, Stuart. Well, you can see the relief from the keeper. He thought that was going in. I certainly did. Redmond now well, a good tackle how about the cross could be oh he's missed but by a minuscule margin well he couldn't have made better contact than that his technique is brilliant he's so unlucky there Bowen wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up James Jones Mullen terrific block Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Into the advanced position. And attempting the through ball. Still not clear. Well, they have it again. The cross is on. And he read it well defensively. James Jones. Useful looking ball. Well, there is a very alert goalkeeper for you. Curtis Davis. Morrison. It's with Lawrence. Well, do they mean business on this occasion? Played into the box. 
Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Opportunity here. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Reese Hall Johnson. And it's with Tozer. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. And threading it forward. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Well, they're doing a fine job of applying pressure here, not giving their opponents time to think or get out of their own half. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Well, the header at least made the goalkeeper think. Morrison. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. And tossing through. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. Goalkeeper error. Diving magnificently to make sure he got there. And woodwork rather than net on that occasion, Stuart. Well, you can see the relief from the keeper. He thought that was going in. Could be. Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Opportunity here. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Reese Hall Johnson. Now let's see what they can do here. Space and time for the cross. Morrison. Has a go. Superb block. for a change there corner kick played in and a harmless effort when all is said and done Well, these stats confirm how poor their finishing has been. Their general build-up play until that final shot has been excellent, and they really should be out of sight by now. Will they live to regret it? Oh, lovely ball. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. Buchanan. Curtis Davis. Here's Jagielka. Bird. Lawrence. On the offensive. And it's played into the centre. 
The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Davis. Well, not the pass he had in mind. And teammates to play it to. Must be! And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. It is to be a throw in. Davis. Jackie Elka. And this situation could be dangerous. Well, the post getting in the way there. And keeper's ball in the end. Well, look at the relief out there. That looked a certain goal, didn't it? Well, they were so close to the equaliser there. They're certainly a bit unlucky, but they need to make more of these chances. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Not a good pass. It's a neat move. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Teammate available. Take it away. In possession, Bowen. Young. Now can they make something happen? And he favours the inside routes. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, he's gone into the referee's notebook. And he can't be surprised. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. Substitution for the visitors. Coming off the pitch, number 10, Paul Muller. Coming on the And they're making a change. 13, Fajiri Okunbehi. A very effective clearance. Well, visionary passing. Making progress. It needs an accurate cross. Surely. Well, not an effort for his own personal scrapbook. Just 10 minutes to go. How can they find a late leveller? Had a chance to whip it in here. Oh, terrific save. Well, that's surely it. That was possibly their last chance. What a great save that was. And they will make the change now.
Corner kick played in. That's someone to play it to. Well, high and more than a bit hopeful. An important interception. Really vital interception here. David Jones. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation. Attacking though they might. Oh! Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So back underway, one goal apiece here. All even, but will it stay that way? And they'll get ready for the throw-in. And he read it superbly. Wasted chance, easy for the goalkeeper. Jones. Well, the keeper should grab hold of it. Well, these players must be motivated. The crowd have been great. Can they now get the winner? Well timed tackle. Locked together then, these two sides, and on we go now to penalty kicks. And now they get the ball rolling. The keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Well, the header at least made the goalkeeper think. Morrison. Oh, a perfectly timed pass, and turns him through. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. Goalkeeper error. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. on that occasion Stuart well you can see the relief from the keeper he thought that was going in could be oh he's missed but by a minuscule margin well he couldn't have made better contact than that his technique is brilliant not quite the clearance they were hoping for opportunity here Superb block. 
corner, kick played in. And a harmless effort when all is said and done. Must be! And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Well, he's gone into the referee's notebook. And he... Surely! Well, not an effort for his own personal scrapbook. And a chance to whip it in here. Oh, a terrific save. Well, that's surely it. That was possibly their last chance. What a great save that was. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation. Attacking, though they might... Oh, a goal! That levels it in the closing phase of this game. It is all about the penalty shootout. Keeper got the touch on the ball, but penalty converted. Job done from the spot. In it goes. And confidently converted. Can he keep us cool? Well, chance wasted. And the penalty converted here. Well, he fired it straight down the middle. And he steps up to take his penalty. And it's gone in. You want a pressure cooker, this is it. He must score. And he has squandered it. That is that. Well, the players are consoling him, but it's not a good penalty, is it? He has to hit the target, and out they go. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Well, the header at least made the goalkeeper think. Morrison. Oh, a perfectly timed pass and tossing through. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. Goalkeeper error. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Woodwork rather than net on that occasion, Stuart. Well, you can see the relief from the keeper. He thought that was going in. Could be. Oh, he's missed.
missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Opportunity here. Has a go. Superb block. Corner kick played in. Not a harmless effort when all is said and done. Must be! And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Well, he's gone into the referee's notebook. Surely! Well, not an effort for his own personal scrapbook. And a chance to whip it in here. Oh, terrific save. Well, that's surely it. That was possibly their last chance. What a great save that was. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation. Attacking, though they might... Oh, a goal! That levels it in the closing phase of this game. And he has squandered it. Oh, hi there. I've just got a couple of questions about the match. Thank you so much for your time. The man to watch. Three goals in his last three games. He's in sparkling form. We'll have the action on EA TV. Hello everyone, the weather forecasters promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson and our live coverage comes to you from League Two it's Wrexham and they take on Carlisle United Thanks Derek as always, this should be a good game great atmosphere inside the stadium we've got two teams full of quality some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football what more could you ask for? So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, they're playing the same shape, really, so it's all about getting control of that central area and which of the wide players has the greatest effect on the game. Thank you. Enjoy the game.
And they kick off here. How about the cross? Well, no problems defensively. Now, someone has scored in one of the other matches. Let's find out exactly who. Alex Scott will tell us. Yeah, it's a goal for Forest Green Rovers. They've scored the opener with only three minutes played. Alex with the info as ever. How can they open up the defence here? It might still be problematic. And a time for calm on the ball. Well, as you can see, when it comes to the hosts, they certainly know a thing or two about scoring goals. In fact, Stuart, they have the most potent attack in the league. Well, in attack, they've been so fluid at home. They just know exactly where the next pass should be going. They've got such a great understanding of the game plan and a lot of credit has to go to the coaching staff. And there to intervene. Intense pressure. And out for a throw-in. Just misfiring with the pass. And threading it forward. Well, even marginally offside is still against the law. Yeah, and he just needed to hold his run for a fraction longer and he would have been in on goal. Will it happen for them? Giving the ball away. Slipshod passing. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. Can they forge ahead? No, chance missed. And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. That is how to apply the pressure. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Well, chance wasted. Well, through on goal, you have to show more sense here. He's just put his head down and whacked it. Not good enough. Reese Hall Johnson. And that's an important intervention. On attacking possibilities. But ultimately up a cul de sac. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Couldn't keep it. Nicely cut out. Has to attack from the wide areas. And played in, attending to his defensive chores. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Big chance! Well, it was a superb counter-attack, but no goal. Yeah, really good play. Won the ball back well and then countered with great speed. That deserved a goal.
Reese Hall Johnson doesn't want to give it away here. Might really be able to trouble them here. Can he give them the lead? And ready to strike. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. Are back underway and 1 0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Oh, big chance! And another one! Two quick goals! Will it turn out to be the two punch knockout? Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Chance to attack using wit. Cross could be useful. Taking care of business defensively here. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Inching towards the interval, and it's going with home advantage. Stewart, as always, very keen to get your take. Well, they've played some really good football up to now. In particular, the way they've got it into their front players has been excellent. I've also liked the movement of the strikers. They just now need to take this forward into the second half. Making sure it didn't get past him. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Getting forward. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Well, rather than stop play immediately, the referee waited and now decides on a yellow card. Could play it in. He's blocked it! Couldn't quite keep it down. Goal kick. So the half-time whistle is sounded, and it's so far so good for the hosts. Well, as we highlighted, they look like a side who will score goals every time they go forward. Their front players have been so clever with their movement. This could turn into a rout in the second half. And they kick off here. Can they forge ahead? No, chance missed. And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Well, they've won the ball back quickly.
Well, chance wasted. Well, through on goal, you have to show more sense here. He's just put his head down and whacked it. Not good. Big chance. Well, it was a superb counter-attack, but no goal. Yeah, really good play. Won the ball back well and then countered with great. Might really be able to trouble them here. Can he give them the lead? And ready to strike. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the... The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Mullen. And they need to get tighter here. Opportunity. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. He made it look simple, really. And he saw the situation developing. Well, possibilities inside the box. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. A really intense pressure applied. It might be on for them. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Cross blocked. And routine for the keeper in the end. The cross far too close to him. I believe there's been a goal in one of the other matches. Alex Scott has the details. Yep, another goal for Forest Green Rovers. It was an early cross which found him in acres of space. And it was a beautiful headed finish. It's now 2-1 with 53 minutes played. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. Must be... That really would have changed the equation had it gone in, Stuart. Well, he needed to score there. That may just have given them some hope. Substitution for Carl And time for the change now. Number 12, John Mellish. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had most of the ball. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, it looked as though he might be on to something, but his timing left a bit to be desired. Yeah, that's frustrating, because he's just been too impatient there. He doesn't need to make his movement quite so early. Here it is now, a substitution. Thirty minutes to go then. And a fine tackle. And he's in. Surely not to be for him. He went for power over placement. Well, you're right. He decided to go for the power, which in the end he couldn't control. He'll be furious with himself. That's a big miss. And with play stopped, they will make the change now.
Dickinson. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Defenders need to cover. And whipped into the box. Absolutely nothing wrong with the idea, but no end product. Well, there's a sound reason why we're focusing on him. He's making his presence felt in attack, Stuart. Well, he's been brilliant today. His skill, his movement, his goals. What a good performance. And he's not finished just yet. Really getting stuck in. Guy. And space for the cross. Oh, surely! Well, unfortunately, he couldn't keep the shot down. And a substitution in the offing. Mullen might be a chance here and he's only gone and made it a hat-trick absolutely unplayable today what a performance Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Three goals without reply. Fifteen minutes left for play. Nicely cut out. He's in here. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Super stop. Well, on the cusp of the final whistle and the home side really prospering today. Stuart, interested to get your take. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. Played into the box. Clattered away. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Can they keep it going? chance to finish well it was a superb counter attack but no goal yeah really good play won the ball back well and then countered with great speed that deserved a goal substitution time it is A sloppy pass. And a throw in forthcoming. It needs an accurate cross. And denied. Great opportunity. And he gobbles up the second chance. Disappointment for the keeper. No wonder he's asking questions of his defence. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one, but they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. Go 
So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. Mullen. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Oh, that is extraordinary! True athleticism to make contact in that fashion, and it's one of the finest goals you're ever likely to see. Simply stunning. Well, as you can see here, it all starts with a perfectly weighted ball in behind the defenders. And then what a strike. The lovely half volley. It's so difficult to keep these down. This is a very tidy finish. Goals in plentiful supply. 4-1 currently. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his booking there. Well, the attack finally comes to nothing, and the keeper has it. Error from the keeper. Will they seize on it? Well, beating his opponent. Not a fantastic piece of defending, was it? And that goes down as a very disappointing attempt. Well, the keeper can't believe his luck. That's a really poor effort. Really closing him down. And there it is, the final whistle, and the fans will be leaving the stadium with smiles on their faces. Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances, we saw an attack which was always threatening, and they played really well. What a performance that was today. And they kick off here. Can they forge ahead? No, chance missed. And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Wasted. Well, through on goal, you have to show more sense here. He's just put his head down and whacked it. Not good. Big chance. Well, it was a superb counter-attack, but no goal. Yeah, really good play. Won the ball back well and then countered with great. Might really be able to trouble them here. Can he give them the lead? And ready to strike. And there it is. 1-0. Their efforts have been rewarded. And look at the... And another one. Two quick goals. Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? He's blocked it. Not to be for him. He went for power over placement. Well, you're right. He decided to go for the power, which in the end he couldn't control. Mullen. Might be a chance here. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. 
chance to finish. Well, it was a superb counter-attack, but no goal. Yeah, really good play. Won the ball back well and then countered with great speed. That... And denied by the keeper. Impressive. And he gobbles up the second chance. Disappointment for the keeper. No wonder he's asking questions of his defence. Mullen. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Oh, that is extraordinary! True athleticism to make contact in that fashion, and it's one of the... Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Just a moment of your time. No further questions, thanks so much.